mysterious looking creature washed up on a beach in Australia. Of course it was Australia, bro. It was a gigantic octopus looking monster with long tentacles and was missing its head. Video footage was released of men dressed in yellow suits quarantining the area and inspecting the creature. However, it was later revealed that this was a marketing ploy from a show called Stranger Things with a villain named Victor. These are some of the strangest and craziest things ever found and they get crazier as we go through this video. I bet you can't make it to the end. This strange twerking looking creature looks like it came straight from the upside down. It's a new species called Burn the House Down. Huh? Most Australians will tell you that it's only 97% deadly. Bruh. I tried to look up some information on this creature so I could tell you guys more about it, but I found out it's faker than your sister's Instagram Bruh. photo. It's just CGI, bro. If you see this, don't let it touch you. But if it does, what will happen next? But before, if you think this baby cat is cute, like, and subscribe. No one falls for that like and subscribe stuff, bro. But if you think I need hair, like and subscribe. Anyway, it looks like he found anti-venom, but this is a cat. This is called a ribbon worm. They shoot out these spiderweb looking things called proboscis, and they are deadly, but not to humans though. But are you gonna be crazy enough to pick up one of those things? Let me know in the comments. Hi Speaking there. of the upside down. Oh, I'm taking a video of her. Oh, look at the baby. Oh, she's doing the spins. She's doing this. It twirled. Hi. Hi there. That horrendous looking thing is called a Dobson fly. And even though it looks like it'll rip your ear off, they are completely harmless to humans. Man, my, my ear fell off. These things only come out at night, and the adult males only live three days, which gives them long enough time to mate. Bro lives long enough to find a girlfriend, and then he dies. Stay single, my boy. I don't need to speak Spanish to know that they're saying, burn the house down. Even though that looks like a demigorgon, that's called a whip scorpion. When they feel threatened, they shoot out this acidic liquid stuff that smells like vinegar. But the good thing here is even though they look like they can rip your eyeballs out, they're practically harmless to humans. These things are actually helpful though. They get rid of all the cockroaches in your house. Ask your mom if she wants me to send her some. Whoa, look at that sky. That is crazy. Now that looks like the upside down. You think that bad guy Victor's gonna show up? Scientists found these hammerhead and silky sharks swimming in underground volcanoes. It's a real shark cano, bro. These sharks were discovered by scientists swimming in the Kavachi underwater volcanoes in the Solomon Islands. It does sound like cat, but it's true. These sharks are able to live in acidic volcanic waters underwater, but not in lava, bro. If you were swimming and you seen this, what would you do? This Jason Voorhees statue was placed underwater to scare scuba divers. It looks so close to the movie that if you were swimming and you've seen that, you would have to change your scuba pants. I'm about to just quit swimming altogether, bro. There what is that? What is that? So this guy, he filmed the sea monster and no one really knows what it is. Some people in the comments said it was a shark or a sturgeon. I don't think it is. I don't think it's an alligator or a crocodile either. What do you think it is? Let me know in the comments. What the heck is that dude doing? My brain is not braining. Are they fishing or is the water fishing for them? Huh? Bro, the cameraman never dies. This is actually called tide fishing and you can do this in the Bay of Fundy in Canada where they have extreme tides. Legend has it, bro's still running from the tide today. These creatures forget to evolve. Looks like an alien planet. Bro, it looks like a shininess of Kabuto from Pokemon. These alien looking creatures are called tadpole shrimps, also called triops. According to scientists, these are some of the oldest living creatures on our planet at 200 million years old. They are one of the oldest living animals on the planet today, longer than your grandpa. And no, I'm not a grandpa. If you see this frog, don't touch it. Okay. Okay. So she shows in this video these frogs with these bright colors. And anytime you see an animal, especially a frog with bright colors, don't touch it, bro. They're poisonous. That's a warning sign to you to leave them alone. What's my next move? I guess it depends on what that tail belongs to. Is that a... I can't tell. No! Oh! Here's my next move. Dude! What is that? Look how big that thing. That thing's bigger than your house. You thought I was gonna say mom, huh? I wouldn't do that to you, mom. Anyway, we got massive AI snakes before GTA 6, bro. I'm a snake. I'm a snake. I'm a slithery little snake and snake. <gasps> That thing looks crazy, man. It's a Grinch snake. No, it's just a puff water snake that's covered in algae. Bruh. That snake has better hair than me. I'm not jelly though. <laughs> wow, look at that. That's scary. I know a Chinese water dragon when I see one. It's just a current, bro. I know I'm being Captain Obvious here, but some people believe anything. I don't like this thing at all. I swear, dude, 
People do dangerous things sometimes. That time Hannibal was so close to her, all he did was smile and wave his head. They're so sweet in real life, I guess. It's an animatronic, but it's still pretty cool though, isn't it? Oh my gosh, it's Miss Kipling. Robbie, come get your lizard. Wow, clean up on aisle five, please. That's a Komodo dragon, and they are highly, highly dangerous. The people in this video are scared, and I would be too. Wow, their mouths are full of bacteria, and they can bite you and make you very sick or even worse. What would you do if you saw that? They are hiding something? I know what it is. It's your mouth. Wait, is that an entire city? It looks like the power lines and tiny houses. That's very... Maybe it's Atlantis, or is this Bikini Bottom, man? If I see a pineapple house, I'm gonna go get it. Wait, never mind. It's in the ocean. I'm not going in there. I'm gonna send an underwater drone to go get SpongeBob, though. I found this creepy SpongeBob house in the woods. Who lives in a pineapple in the woods? You my Now that's strange. Someone built an entire SpongeBob house in the woods. It would have been cooler if they'd have put it in the water in that last video, though. In the bottom of the ocean. Pouring for a minute. Looks like that tree has some gut issues. Like it needs medicine. Looks like it ate Taco Bell. That's a lot of water, man. Why are you trying to scoop it out? That's crazy. I know usually this happens when there's a hole at the top of the tree and it's hollow and it collects rainwater over time. But this thing's like it's got a whole water fountain in it. That's a lot of water. Like it busted a water pipe. That's crazy. Look, that's making a whole river. It's not a waterfall, it's a tree fall. Bro, just cut the tree. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's crazy. There's this gigantic tree in Africa called the Boabab tree. And people actually use it to store water and food. And they even use it for shelter. What is that? I can't... Is that eyes? Bro, that looks like Howard the Duck. Is that Casper the Ghost? Why is he using 1987 flip phone in 2024? What? Look at this. That's scary and beautiful. That thing is massive. It's a chandelier deer. Or would it be a chandelier deer? Heavy is the head and wears the crown, I guess. Now this is not CGI, and it's actually real. Deers actually shed their antlers every year, and they grow back faster and bigger. He must have shed his antlers every week. Men in black is real. It's even got a twerking booty going on. Now this is CGI, and I know it's fake, and that slug is in shape, but look at me, bro. I'm in shape too. Bruh. What? Rounds of shape? Oh my gosh. Look at how big, hairy, and scary that thing looks. Just like your dad. That spider is real and it's not CGI. That is a huntsman spider. And even though they look like they'll tear your head off, they're actually pretty harmless to humans. This video is just a close up shot though. It's only about nine inches though. Meat? Bro said meat. <laughs> He's cute though. That bird said more in this video than some people say in their foolish tweets in their entire lifetime. He even shrugged his shoulders to let you know what he's saying. This is called an American woodcock. Let me know in the comments what you think he's saying. What the heck is this? Bro, it took my brain a whole 10 seconds to figure out that's a proboscis monkey. He looks like a villager in Minecraft. Is that a dead T-Rex? Looks like it died just two months ago. Poor born in a purple dinosaur has been through a lot in the last 20 years. It's actually just a sculpture in Germany. Every time I go to chase it, what it is runs. it? I don't think it's a good idea. I what don't chase it anymore. It? You might think I'm what is it? Though. Is this a jump scare? Every time. What is it? I see him. I, I see, see him. him. Like I like I see him. Dude, what is it? I see him right there ducking. <gasps> oh, what the hell is wrong? What is it? Mine or his? Why is he Me? Like Who are you that? talking to? Bro, we about to. I want to try to zoom. What's he talking about? I don't even see what he, Oh! Oh my god, why does he look like Is that? he talking about the ghost looking kid or talking about me? We about to fight this. Ah! Ew! Is that a human fingers or is that animal fingers? I can't tell, honestly. I've been trying to figure this out. Let me know in the comments, what do you think this is? This massive creature was found on a beach and it's not what you think it is. And if you want to find out more about it, click on this video. But I also made this one for you to check out too.